Welcome, welcome, welcome. Here we are. We have me and Fell right now. Uh, I don't know what, I just... The video is going to be, well, some farming. There's an eye doc that we're, that's smoking right now. There's actually two eye docs. The other one isn't smoking. So, we're going to do a little of this and a little of that. When I first started this game, I had a sword fighter. That's who I started out with. And I farmed... Farmed in a few places to get going, and I wasted a lot of time in a lot of places, but when you're first starting, you don't know anything, and I played OSI, but that really doesn't, it showed you a little bit what to play, but UOA is a lot different. <laughs> so, right here is my house. As you can see, I'm uh, in Fell. I'm just north of uh, Vesper. Across the bridge and go up the road a ways to that block. We had an eye dock right here, which was a castle. And I put a... After the two-hour limit, I uh, put me up a castle. I think there was a couple other people that were interested, but... I kind of made it obvious I was wanting to use this spot, so I did. And <clears throat> here's where we are. Got the downstairs area here. I still ain't decided exactly what I'm gonna do with this over in here. It's, I've got, I've got cows and and I, I put a bird birdhouse up in this tree and uh, just some animals there. Very a lot of animals around my house. They are kind of noisy at times, but I don't really notice them anymore. <clears throat> So, I don't know if anybody's ever up this direction. I think I got this set to, I don't remember. Because this, this guy that I'm on right now, this is my main player, but he don't own the castle. One of my other guys does on another account. But anyway, I've got two room books here. This has got full of dungeons, and this one's full of uh, islands. You are uh, Tram and Fell, so if you're ever up this way, I might put a few more books out there of stuff as I fill them. And I kind of made a moat kind of deal here, all around here. Got some few boats out there. My two vendors here don't have stuff on them, but one's my older brother, which he's in the game, uh, Mikey. Or uh, Cabot, as a lot of them know him by. And this is my other brother that passed away. This is Bob. So. I kind of made a... Here's uh, the main floor of the house. I'm still... I got so much decoration and stuff to put out. I... And I've had this castle for, I don't know, a month or so. I just... Uh, too many other things I'm doing. Here's the roof. Got an arcane circle up here. Uh, oops. These are all my... Uh, my deals to make my enhanced bandages. They're all running. Got stuff in them. And then, what are you doing in here? Animals, I gotta do something. <laughs> All these animals keep coming in my house. Uh, anyway, this is the main part of the house. I don't see, you don't see much, but uh, other people have done this, so I did it. This lower part, this lower part, which you can see over here, if you go out on the dock, See, the water goes underneath there. So, go back up here, and we hit, oh, went off the side. Hit this transporter, 
And now you're in my main part of my house. And I keep this private under here. Oh, all my power scrolls and stuff. I finally filled up a tran transcendence book, so now I got my second one there. And uh, oh, this all your stuff you need to be able to have a ha have a a fun time here. I make my own bandages. I go out and farm a lot of a lot of cotton, and I make bandages. I mean, they're 600. Oh wow! I forgot I was that low. If anybody, any new players happen to watch this, what you want to do, if you want to learn how to play this game, Trillion the Red has a part one and a part two of beginning in this this game. Watch watch them both. She tells you all the little secrets and and uh, stuff to do to make your game a lot easier to play. Which that's why I have this stuff here, and so I keep my bandages in there. And, uh, arrows and bolts because I my thing is set to scavenge them so I grab them from iDocs when we're out fighting I sell them on my vendor in, in New Haven a lot of stuff I sell on my vendor in New Haven <coughs> so uh, all my soul stones I've only gotten since the new thing with the soul stones I think I've gotten three now that I've changed over to me that were somebody else's but anyway this is from one account and this is on a different account uh, there's my two guys the creator and curious George curious George owns this owns the castle uh, the creator which I'm gonna take this house down but he owns this house over here it's right behind my brother's house which is right there yeah I made it so I could come to his house real easy. You know, got to keep an eye on him. See what he's doing. <laughs> so, anyway, let's run up and uh, let's check the eye doc. Let me look at my oh my Discord. Forgot to put it up on my third screen. Uh, smoking still. I didn't say it's dropped. So let's run up there real quick. This is already ready. Oh no, it fell. Well, guess what? Nobody put active on the deal. Which I just did. Gift of life. Come on. Get in there. the last one. Oh, there, no. Whoa. Whoa, whoa. <sighs> well, he's playing stupid right now.
getting killed there. Still in there fighting. Stick of the devil. There he is. Get over here. I don't know if the Red Death got me or what it was. It's kind of tough down in these uh, close quarters like this.
turn my uh, auto loot off. It'll stop all these messages down here. Turn, I keep trying to loot stuff. Well, for anybody new that's watching, new to the game, this is an eye dock. You can die real easy. You don't watch out. I use wildfire a lot. It doesn't do a lot of damage, but it does do damage. But you can't let it hit the uh, guardian that's over here. See, so you cast it back by you, especially if you've got arcane circle going. Cause I, it'll do a square, you know, that big. <clears throat> so you gotta, you gotta cast it back by yourself or behind you sometimes. You can see the guardian right there. There's the guardian in the gate. Well, that's it. Done. Kill my war. Oh, get off there. Get off there. I'm picking up arrows. <laughs> I've got plenty of time to get stuff out of the box. Up here, hit control shift, and you can find the unstable chest. I do it like this pull it over to the side, and then put my little box up there beside it. Just drag the stuff across. stump. I don't know if I have one of them. I may. I don't remember. I'll drop that on the ground probably because I don't want it. I've got a couple of them already anyway. Now, you can, you can, anybody can go to IDOX. Uh, you don't have to be have a pet or trained up. You can do if you had if you have only magic. You can either you can heal people and res people, and you still get credit. Uh, let's 
a good way to get started out. Some people drop stuff on the ground, so you can uh, might be a good chance to get something up here for free. I don't want anything else. Everybody wants to look in the boxes. Nothing in there. for a good pile. Oops, was that a... Uh yeah, those are, I like those chests. You can, King Arthur chests, you can walk over. Doesn't matter that they're sticking out there. Oh. Okie doke. That's that one. And then let's look. See if anybody changed it yet. If they didn't, I'll change it. Come on, Discord slide. What are you doing? Do a little bit of housekeeping here. Uh, not that it's anything special, but I'm a on the mod of this channel for the iDox. So, I usually leave them up for about two hours. Then I delete the thread or the post, which was about telling about the iDoc. But I change it and put done at the top so people can see that it's done. So they don't click on it. Oh, I didn't even notice. Look at that. He almost killed me. I was looking at Discord, not... Not watching my screen. And it, you can't hear the sound when I know I'm not clicked on that screen. That was pretty... You guys could have got, got to see me get killed. If I wouldn't have noticed it. Uh, let's run and look at the other eye dock real quick. Make sure... It's in fell. Oh, yeah, she did make it different wrong. I'll fix it for her. <laughs> no, that's right. There we go. Now her post is right. Anyway, this is this is the other eye dock right here. You see, danger of collapsing. <laughs> it's in fell right outside. Right outside Vesper. But, uh, oh yeah, I died. 
I forgot. When you dot, what in the world was that? Oh, that's that pile. That looks weird. How that laid in there. <laughs> Doesn't really look like a, a pile of armor. <laughs> well, we gotta go back to the house anyway. I gotta put my stuff back in my box like it goes. And here we go. Okay. Right up here and in the house. And for just for giggles. Do that like that. Oh. Uh, there's a 115, 115, 115, 110, and a 110. We got one pink, one blue. I've got so many stinking maps. I need to start doing them. My Davies, uh, whatever it's called, the table down there, and my upstairs. It is just plumb full of them. Uh, two fertile dirt. I'm not putting all the armor out there. That. Then, we take a picture of it. Save. We save it in the iDoc, my iDoc pile. <coughs> there we go. Now that's saved. Uh, I'll do them later. Pull this over here like this. All this stuff back in here, it pops it out of there when you die. I hate that. I picked up 73 arrows. Just to get this out of my bag. Send that to the bank. See these king, these, uh, what are they? King Arthur's chests? They're a little smaller. But look, you can walk right over them. It doesn't stop you. Like right here, I try to walk and I can't. I, I run into it. But these, you can walk right over. Which is pretty dang cool. I think I'll put it right there. Well, I guess now we will go do some farming. I'm going to get a drink. Okay, I got a few places I went, used to go when I was a new player, and they're not too bad. <clears throat> One, well, you know what, I would just take my rune and go there, but I'm not going to. Oh. Uh, Go to a moon gate. And you select Islinar and Valor. Now you're at the Valor gate. And if you look here on my map, this is Valor. We're going to start out, we're going to go right over here. There's Cyclops Gardens and the King Encampment. And there's Titans and Ettons. This place is really easy to farm. You don't have to be real tough. Plenty of room to run. Uh, you can get away real easy. Uh, if you want to, hand, heads, want to hand up, Make sure you watch Trillion's videos, Trillion the Red, she's on YouTube, 
she tells you how to get everything set up for you can target things and it's a real she's got two videos or one and two watch them you'll learn a lot so oh and if you can notice <laughs> you don't always notice uh, I gotta remember which button it is see the trees trees are gone you can set that up in a macro to do that let me look real quick options macros you'll have all these too eventually remove trees yep it's under your uh, your macros is toggle tree stumps just set that on a hotkey and go for it it's so much easier to get around with no trees all them canopies it just it hides everything you can get around a lot easier like this go right over here yeah there's little snakes they're bothersome Now, if you're just starting out, you're a fresh cut, you're a fresh person in this game. You're just sword fighter. And you got very high skills. What you do is kind of sneak up here, get over to the side, and you can draw them out one at a time. I think two of them saw me. There's one. Did I get this one. Yep. So you can get them like that, you get them one-on-one, -on -one, you can kill them a lot easier. And if you're a sword fighter and you're just starting, you won't kill them that fast. There's four of them in there, and there's usually many out here. You'll find Ettons and more of them guys, Cyclopians, uh, Titans. There's a Titan. I use uh, classic UO with a razor and an enhanced razor. You know, if you don't want to dabble, if you don't want, if you feel scripting is bad, whatever. This game, he allows you to script a lot of skill gain, which leaves you time to play the game. But you just want to use enhanced razor for the looting and for the uh scavenging you can set like right there it just it just grabbed all the gold for me i didn't have to stop each one of them grab the gold put it on my guy <laughs> paragon snake run around there and there's all that kind of stuff right there to kill and you make pretty good gold I mean there's almost 2,000 gold right there just from that little bit uh, down here by this river uh, is it right there yeah to see the river runs around like that there's some bad stuff right in through here and if you're not don't have some skill built up they can be a little overwhelming
out some poisoning stuff. See, there's liches. <laughs> so you can run right through them. If you got a mount, and if you're new to the game, you get free gifts right from the get go. Like three of them, I think, or four, or whatever it is. Hey. And you can get you a, a, a horse to ride right off the bat. An ethereal horse. So, uh, Spectre. But if you want to try to kill stuff right there, I mean, just, you need a little skill, but you can get to it eventually. Uh, down here, you start getting up into here. This over here, this is all. This is dragons. I don't remember what else is over there. Mostly dragons. There's a spawn right there. The champ ball at Valor, Valor champ spawn is right there. It's just the regular one. I mean, I forgot about all this. I haven't been down here for a while. But anyway, that's a good place to go uh, get stuff. If we go to... Uh, if you want to go to you... Okay, here's you. There's the U Moon Gate. You come straight down from there. This is where I used to have a house right here. This is in Fell, or then in Tram. Me and my brother had houses right here. But if you go right down here by this road right here, see, there's all kinds of things to kill, and they're all that low. It's not real, it's not real dangerous stuff. But if you need to make gold. To buy you a little bit of armor or whatever. Get your rune book and some runes and makes the game a little bit easier, a little funner to play. And that's what we're looking to have is fun. Get a little bit better. There is a dungeon down here it's called Sanctuary. Now you almost you need to have a little bit of skill to get in there, not get in there to go there, because anybody can go there. I'm not gonna run all the way down there. I have a dungeon book. And sanctuary, spelled wrong, <laughs> in there, is right here. And see, we we're right up, we we're right up there. You just keep running down the road, past the crossroad that goes up to you. You keep going, keep going, keep going. Flare down here. See, uh, Scarab Braves right here, and Brit is over here. So I'll give you your bearings where you're at. It's in the side of this mountain. And you run clear down here. Oops. Get off him. Oh, didn't get him. 
get that. <laughs> See, my guy is a spellweaver or uh, tamer. A tamer, spellweaver, what do you call it? That's what he is. So I can do Gift of Life. Come on, doppelganger. <laughs> Not till the uh, the paragon targets me. Then the doppelganger probably says, "Hey, I see you." Now you gotta watch out, cause if you're a new player, that was and paragons aren't they're not simple for a new guy. But this is a good place to farm. See, we're already up 3,800. There's a Titan. I invest <laughs> or hid. Sorry. Now they're starting to hurt him a little bit. Org brute. Looks like an overgrown titan. Sucker, hit me. I didn't do anything to you, my horse did. Highly advise that you get a get you a tamer. Pets are come easier. They do. I've only bought a couple pets. The rest of them I've got on iDox. Now I did buy this this mare because he was rare. <laughs> oh my. I've never seen three of them right there before. That's kind of wild. There's a Titan and three Brutes. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. You just get away from them. Even they overwhelm me once in a while. See, I jumped out and went down around. There's a second out exit right there. They can overwhelm me just as well as a new uh, a new player easily. That guy shot me with something there. But this is a good place to farm. So I'm already up to 5,600 already. So that's a place to go.
It's right outside this doorway. Doorway. Right outside the entrance to the dungeon. Is a bunch of stuff. Sorry, my mic keeps hitting my face. But that'll get you some, some cash right off the bat to buy stuff with. If you're a, if you're playing a sword fighter, which is what you need to do, the ideal thing to do is see how you get in a group of stuff like that. You need to get chivalry, and one of your main things is going to be whirlwind. And get you an axe. It gives you a good axe. And you want to find an axe. You want to find or buy an axe. It gives you mana refill. And uh, and uh, hit point regen. And you can. You can do good. That's how I started out. And you can find. You can find. Uh, armor like that. Or weapons like like that I've saved a few I don't play my I don't play my sword fighter anymore I haven't played him forever That's not a very good one. These are good ones, but there's hit fireball. Here's mana leech and life leech, 56 and 50. Yep. Oh no, but both 56. And that one's light or, uh, mana leech and mana drain. Oh. There's life leech, 84%. You get one of them, you start doing Whirlwind, and he kills everything around him. Get you good, well, you can't have a shield, but just get you a good set of armor. Uh, let's see if I can find my, I never can remember which box it is. I think it's the white one. Here we go. This was that, I don't know if that, if that thing's, if that guy's gone or not doing anymore. See, this was the armor you got right here. Armor we into mission. Uh, but you, once you put all these on there, on to, all together, I think it got you up to almost 70. If I remember right. I haven't had it on forever. But see how it's gray? It turns a dark purple when you put it on. It's real pretty. Oh, I forgot. Oh, I did have gloves. I got another pair of gloves for my Santa suit. Ah, uh, there's just some armor that I've kept. I used to have a whole bunch in here, but I've got, I got rid of a bunch of it. I didn't need it. Uh, see, so you just start out, and you'll start getting armor, and you'll start, you know, you'll get better armor, and you'll find better armor. Or on these eye docks, that's where I've gotten most of my armor that I wear. See, that one's legendary, which I need to go repair it. That one's legendary. That one's greater. I think my arms are. Where are my arms at? Oh, you know what? Oh, I forgot to put the goldens on there, too. Oh, that's... Well, you just saw that. I don't have my arms. They're not on me. Huh. I think they were legendary too. They weren't damaged that much. I just looked at all that stuff last night. I was messing with that. Oh, they're not in here. 
I was taking that stuff off the other night. I had just I just repaired not too long ago. Sometimes in a battle, they'll knock stuff off you. They knock my boots off all the time. They might have got, they might have got down to zero and just and and got destroyed. I don't know. That's funky. I hate that it does this. Stick stuff behind other stuff. Well, I'm glad I looked at that. And they... See, my helmet's legendary. I need to repair it. But they're... They weren't down that much. For some reason, my arms get hit quite a bit. And I don't know why. Well, that agitates me. That was a nice set of arms. They were legendary. I'll have to see what I can... Uh... Man. Oops. Wrong box. The only arms I have besides them... Is these right here? Huh. Well, what was them on for right now? Hey. What's up with that? Something's goofy. My arms may be on there still. We're getting these fixed. You see, it won't let me put them on there. So you know what you do in that case? You do this right here. We're gonna hide, log out, log back in. And looky, there's my arms. They were on there all the time. They're not colored. I see you color them. Uh, see, that happens right there. I said, I've told people this happens before. I've came in my house and tons of stuff are missing. Log out, log back in. It's all there. Okay, that makes me feel a lot better. I, say, I just repaired not too long ago. See, if you go here when you get your new player, you get your rewards. Go here, go to Ethereal Steeds, and the first, there'll be one thing up here, be the horse. Get it. You may not use it forever. You can see right here is all my pets. And I've got two horses. I've got my uh, llama on me. He's in my box right here. He's right there. Uh, that's an ethereal. That's an ethereal. That's an ethereal. Uh, 
Yeah, there it is. That white tiger is ethereal, or that regular tiger is ethereal too. And the rest of these are my pets. I don't play a lot of them anymore. I used to play Venom quite a bit. And then my Dexter. He's my Discord one. He's my Discord Unicorn. I need to... Yeah, I don't think he has any points left on him anymore. He's 113. I wish... this. I made him back when I was a lot newer to the game. It didn't didn't put a lot of scrolls on him I should have that's why what I'm writing right now Lucifer here he is this is why he's pretty mean see he's uh, 120 necromancy 120 spirit speak 120 eval only 115 Majory because they want too much money for 120 Majory scrolls. All these 115s. No, he got knocked down a little bit when he died last. He'll get that back up, no problem. But see, I've still got uh, 420 points on him. Because I may go ahead and put that to 120. And I want to get it. If I ever get a 120 wrestling, I want to raise his wrestling up to 120. And the rest of them, I could, I got enough to do it. He's pairing 120, 900 hit points, 1,051 mana. He's pretty tough, pretty tough mare. That's why I play him a lot. Okay, well let's go, let's go repair. And let's repair and let's uh, color my uh, armor. Okay, let's go here. Let's go to the rune library. Because that's a repair for free. Come in here. Oops, I didn't want to do. Click on the table, on the repair table. Uh, fix my helmet. Another one. A shield. Now we go to sewing kit and do my gloves. Do my arms. My tunic. Oh, pants didn't need it. Uh, my sash. That doesn't need repair. I think that's everything. Are they? No, they are brown. See. So then you go upstairs here. Yeah, somebody's in there painting, coloring something. Clear down to this one, push OK, and do that. Go to the arms. There we go. Now they're blue like the rest of my stuff. I want the cosmic blue for my 
for my shroud, but they want way too much gold for it, too much uh, sobs for it. Okay. There's that. We showed you how to repair and to dye your stuff right there. This is the rune library, which you go right here, check your champ spawns. Uh, marble's active right now. I like doing, I do desert and uh, ice. I'll do ice. E, well, I guess I've done both of them probably. Desert I do the most, or the or uh, desert I do the most. I could actually probably do it right now by myself, well, not by myself. But as you get valor, you can do them. Down one notch. But anyway, well. That's, uh, got to see an eye doc. Uh, let me look and see if the other eye doc is. Oh, we got a new one. Where's this one at? <laughs> Insert item count. These guys. I usually go count them. Three minutes ago. That's gamer. Uh... Let's go look at this other one real quick. Oh, that's the other one. Oops, wrong one. It was in fell. I need to take that one out of my... And it is... Uh, this one right here, smoking, oh, wrong one, Perry, this one, And it's not smoking, so when did she do it last? Oh well, wow, it hadn't been done for Yep, that's it. <clears throat> okay, let's look. Uh This is in Fell, and I am in Fell. If you're ever curious, enter the left bracket, which is right above your period, and then you push uh, where, and it would tell you. Oh. See so right down here it says the address or where you're at and what facet. I'm in Feluca. So we go up here, we go there, and we're looking at the what they posted. 1663, 1663 space, 1226. There, and there it is. Oh, it's right outside Co Covetous. Okay, that's easy. Uh, let's look at my fell book first. I don't know. Let's don't look there. Let's look at my dungeon book. I don't know if I have... That's, uh, Trammel. 
Oh darn, I don't have one. Well, let's look in the bell book then. See if I happen to have anything close to it. You can see it's right there. Oh, that's not covetous. Okay. I didn't... See, this is a mess up you can do real easy. Scroll out. That looked like... It looked like this right here. I was thinking it was right there. This is just north of Brit. Uh, okay. Uh, fell Brit, though. Uh, I thought I had, uh... Oh, and there it was. There was cover this spell. Too bad that ain't where I needed to go. I thought I had the Brit Swamp. Here this is. Ah! Perfect. I thought that room was right up here somewhere. So it just said northwest of Brit. Huh, Matt Boy's counting. Oh my. Look at that. You can read the names. Eleven thirty three, he says. Let's see what I get.
Do 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 Eight forty nine so far. I don't know what I missed. Ah, I can't see those. see a lot more than I do. I trust his count. So we'll do this. I'll fix it for him. Eleven thirty three. that right there that he's talking about. Huh, it doesn't have a name. So, right up here, and mark the spot, and like I do it, let me go, well, I dock. 1133 ITEMS. And there, put that in my book. You see, it comes up. Fell IDOC 1133 items. And when you follow it, now see over here, well, you can't see it. In my Discord, under my favorites for this Discord, I have them listed. So we've already done that one. 
this was the 488 which is this one which it needs to go down one and then what's next above it is the fell 113 I keep them in the book the same way they're in my favorites so I can find them real easy Actually, so 113 or 1, 1133 and 113. There's 113. There's 1113. So I can actually get rid of this one. We'll drop that rune. Now they're in my book, just like I do on the my favorites. So it's easier to go check on them. Let me see what temperature is out. I need to get a shower. Let me see what's going on here. Well, it's only 50 degrees out. We had 80s a couple days ago. Now we're down to 50s. Well, I think that's probably going to be it for now. You see it's my docks and did some farming. I'm currently training two pets. Uh, this little guy. Oh, I, oh, I put him in my, he's in my uh, stable. Anyway, I got him I'm training. <coughs> then I have one of them, uh, whatever they're called, Suki, Tuki, Tuki, whatever wolves, which he's a rare. This guy's not a rare. He's just a cool, cool little guy. But I'm trying to do both of them too right now. One, uh, the wolf, he's at 70 some on his second, second training. So. I'll probably be working on them too. But anyway, uh, ooh, that's about an hour and a half video. That's okay. Some people like long ones. I do. But until next time, uh, please like and subscribe if you like watching my videos. They're not real fancy, but I have fun. But anyway. Have a great day.